Hey guys, um, so a, a common question that I've been getting is around business formation. Um, so I'm, I'm not a CPA, I'm not an attorney. Um, before you make any decisions, it's, it's always best to seek professional advice. Now, that being said, um, I always get questions around whether or not somebody should set up an LLC or what type of business formation they should utilize. Um, me personally, when I started out, I started out with a sole proprietor. Um, and then eventually, as my business grew, started making more money, set up my store, had a warehouse, had employees. I converted over to an LLC. Now, the reason why you do that, um, the LLC provides you certain protections. We live in a very litigious society. And, um, you know, a LLC will separate your business assets from your personal assets. So if somebody sues you for a business related issue or problem, they can't go after your personal assets in most cases. So um, that's why you want to set up an LLC as you grow. But initially, a sole, a sole proprietor is fine because that it's very easy to set up. It's very inexpensive to maintain. And it, it'll allow you to write off your business expenses, your mileage, your feeder bills. Um, uh, uh, if you're breeding out of your house, uh, the percentage of square footage that you're using in your house, all of those are really, really good tax write-offs to help reduce your taxes. So that's really, really critical. Um, and even if you started the hobby two, three years ago um, and you still have your receipts from two, three years ago, when you set up your business as a sole proprietor, you can write off those expenses. Those are basically startup costs. So save your receipts, save your invoices. Um, you know, if you, if you, when you buy a snake, make sure you get an invoice. Uh, when you buy your feeders, make sure you get an invoice, etc. Uh, download a mileage app on your phone. Track the mileage whenever you go to FedEx, drop off, pick up snakes, etc. Track all of that. All of that is a tax deduction. <clears throat> Once you get big and you're making money and you have an LLC, how you structure that LLC is important too. You could do LLC as a C corp or you could do it as an S corp. Again, talk to your CPA. For years, <clears throat> I was losing a lot of money because I was playing, paying self-employment tax. When you set up as an S-Corp, you can pay yourself a salary and the rest of the money you can distribute to yourself as a distribution. Now, that'll save you a lot of money in taxes because you'll only play, pay the self-employment tax on the money that you receive through payroll. So talk to a CPA, um, especially when you start making money, uh, you, you want to reduce your taxes. It's not about how much you make. It's about how much you keep. So remember that. I hope this was helpful. If you guys have any additional questions, you can post them below in the comments. I'll try to respond if I have an answer, but it's always good to seek, uh, seek uh, professional advice and find a good CPA. All right. Take care, guys.